Second detail to take note of is no other than Isagi, like really guys. He's the worst character in this episode. All he ever did was to cry and mope around because nothing makes sense to him. And I really like the fact that Raichi told him that he sucks. A much needed reinforcement from Raichi. And Nagi going even further by calling him useless and inefficient. You know, as much as I like talking trash at Isagi because he's a really bad main character, all of this trash talk is just eh levels of writing why because really guys it just made it more obvious that isagi will have an involvement in the winning goal for team zay whether that happens or not whether it be him scoring the winning goal or doing an assist or simply doing an important step in the build-up of play you know for sure isagi will have his moment even ego prophesized it and I dislike it, not because it was telegraphed to us in advance, but because the stupid blue lock fans will call it hype again next week when it could not have been more obvious. And one last detail before I end this review, the portion where Chigiri and Zantetsu were having a moment. You know guys, I never really cared about the animation. I think it's alright for the most part, but really, this particular moment the animation is terrible. They literally just slideshowed the moment of the characters. Like, what the F is this? There's a background and they're just sliding a picture of the character to imply movement when it couldn't look more terribly. This is just bad. And by far the worst animated scene I've ever witnessed from the show since episode 1. I feel like they did Chigiri and Zantetsu wrong here. They deserve better animation than this. And with that said, that's basically it for me for this episode. I thank you all for watching and see you guys in the next episode.